This problem says if 250 mg of cefalzolin powder are diluted with the water up to the 250 ml mark, what is the percent, what is the percent concentration of the drug in final solution? So from the definition of percent, we know that uh, the per percent means how many grams present per 100 ml. So we definitely need 100 ml in the denominator in order to express the final concentration in percent unit. So let's uh, go ahead with the expression. We have 250 milligram of the drug dissolved per 250 ml uh, solution. So we're going to write it like this. We're going to use the dimensional analysis, not any uh, shortcut formula. So it's going to be 250 milligram present in 250 ml of the solution and we need to convert express it to 100 ml so what we're going to do we're going to bring a new entity as 100 ml in the denominator numerator and the same thing in the denominator so so the whole idea is leaving this part aside so that we can finish all the calculation and only we have gram unit in the numerator and 100 ml in the denominator so we're going to multiply this with and and we need to convert the milligram to gram it's going to be uh, one gram over one thousand milligram now if you pay attention carefully this milligram this milligram cancel out and uh, this ml this ml cancel out we're not going to touch this 100 ml we're going to leave this 100 ml as it is and at the end of everything we'll have a some number with a gram over 100 ml as the final unit so we're going to rewrite it after doing all the calculation this 250 250 cancel out so this is going to be 0 0.1 the numerical value but the unit is going to be gram in the numerator and 100 ml in the denominator so we have 0 0.1 gram present per 100 ml and we all know that this this is the other expression of percent so we can just replace this with the percent sign so this is going to be 0 0.1 percent this is the answer